like the one I have here. I begin with Lisa Wright, Lisa's powerful word processing tool, and I type my memo. Then I add the Lisa Calc model I just copied by positioning the pointer and pressing the mouse button. I get a vertical flashing bar to show me where the insertion will be. When I choose Paste from the Edit menu, the model is added into my memo. I can also insert text, say a heading above this model. Again, I select my insertion point and just type. I can even center it and then change the text style. How about bold? I can work with any document until it looks the way I like. And then with Lisa's printer, well, I can copy the document exactly as it appears on the screen. Now, I could send this memo off now, just as it is. But if I wanted to make the critical budget information obvious at a glance, I should graph it. With Lisa, we can draw different kinds of like bar charts, pie charts, and line charts. Here's that budget again. Now I'm going to select just the critical information. Next, I copy that information just as I did before and get the graphics document we wish to create. I select the place I want the information to go and choose Paste. The procedure used is the same one we used when we moved information to Lisa Wright earlier. To the right of the graph, there are legends. Now I edit these words the same way I do in all Lisa documents, by selecting and typing. But what if the information I was trying to convey would look better in a different configuration? Say, in a line or pie chart. The transformation occurs almost instantly. To complete the graph, I can add titles in different type styles and sizes, just as I could in the memo. Amazing how much can be done so quickly. Whether I was working with Lisa Calc or Lisa Wright or any other function, I control Lisa almost exclusively with the mouse, and always in the same way. The keyboard I used only for entering text or numbers. Now, of course, sometimes I'll want a drawing that Lisa Graf can't provide. But I won't need an artist or this drafting table. All I'll need is Lisa Draw, a freeform graphics package that allows me to develop custom graphics. Here's how that's done. This is a piece of Lisa Traw paper onto which I've pasted the chart that you saw earlier. I can now explode a section of the pie, duplicate it, and shade it with a different fill pattern. I can then rearrange these objects to produce a drop shadow. If I want to further customize my pie chart, I can select all the lines and make them bolder. I can also move text, and now add something new. By choosing this particular template, I can always draw perfectly straight lines. I could even print this out exactly as you see it here. Amazing? Not really. Lisa just makes it easier for you to do a lot of the things that you're doing already, but better. Finally, Lisa will help me make a distribution list for this report on the Opus project. Let me show you how. This document is a list of all the employees in the company. It contains their names, mail stop, departments, and other information about them. Suppose I wanted to send this report to everyone on the Marketing Council. I select the Find What option on the list menu. Go to the Marketing Council column and type Yes. 
After I tell Lisa to find and show, I get only those employees on the marketing council. Since I don't want all this information on my distribution list, I choose what order and format. And I can now say no in those columns that I want omitted. I can also sort this list by mail stop. Now let's look at the revised list. Note that I have everyone on the marketing council in order by mail stop. You can see that working with just the mouse, I have a lot of flexibility. In just one morning, I revised a schedule, adjusted a budget, wrote a memo that contained part of the budget, created a graph based on the budget and customized the graph. Finally, I distributed the report to selected employees. And now I can take an empty folder I've named Opus Project and put all my documents into this one folder so they'll be easy to find. You know, Lisa's software is so complete these six comprehensive applications cover all the business functions that are most important to me. Spreadsheet modeling, charts and graphs, list management, text processing, project management, and presentation graphics. And because of the attention Apple has paid to making these graphics and this mouse work for me, well, I need to learn only one way of doing things to work all the applications. And since Apple has thoroughly considered the needs of the business person, Lisa also communicates to the central computer that I share with other managers. And of course, my company can use Lisa's development languages to customize its own programs. Do yourself a favor. Ask to see how the power of Lisa can work for you.